Hey, this is Grant Hill at the Big Dance, and you are watching Duke Blue Planet. What's up guys, uh, just got to Columbia, South Carolina, checking in a hotel, getting ready to get some good food and we'll see you guys later. What's up Duke fans, it's day one of the big dance. We're at Brooklyn KC High School, which is a beautiful facility. Getting a nice walkthrough in and getting ready to head over to the arena here in a few for media day. A lot of questions to be answered. And then we take the court for open practice for the great fans here in South Carolina to see our guys in action and we're ready to get rolling. We're ready to take it one game at a time. North Dakota State tomorrow. Let's go Duke. Andre Dawkins, you're watching Duke Blue Planet. We're out here in South Carolina getting ready for the start of March Madness. Let's go, Duke. What's up, everybody? It's Mike Buckmeyer here. Um, clearly, a lot of these times when the media is in here, uh, myself and Zion have kind of been in front of the media answering questions. I've been accompanying him. So he's actually about to come in here, so we want to give you guys kind of a behind the scenes of what it's like to face the media um, for here during the March Madness. So Zion, with um, you, and both of you, you, you've gotten so excited to always be part of March Madness. Now it's official. What goes through your mind? You watched March Madness grow up as a little kid. You say you want to be a part of it, but to actually be a part of it and be like number one seed, is, I mean, I couldn't ask for much more. Hey, what are your thoughts on North Dakota State? Yeah. I'm gonna let you start with that one. But what are your thoughts? So they're a very good team. Clear their championship caliber team. They, yeah, they space the floor, shoot the ball. So it should be a very good game. We're excited for it. A lot of people like Easy. Really, you're a likable guy, yeah. I like it. I feel better about myself. It says your chemistry as a duo has improved over the season. What do you make of it? So we did as a, a joke at first, turned into something serious. Like, we was like, every time I come to the locker room, like, hold on, we're going to start this without Michael Buckmeyer. I know which questions to answer him, and, you know, he gives the best responses. Uh, with tomorrow on game day, of course, a little bit of nerves, but what, what, what goes through your mind? You know, Coach K has taught us a lot about, you know, just living in the moment and being in the moment. So. When I'm out there, I'm just going to enjoy being out there with my teammates and, you know, just have fun because I love playing basketball. When I'm having fun, I feel like that's when I'm playing my best. How do you handle, how do you handle all this, this this right here? How do you, how do, you do it? I mean, you just got to have fun. Like, you know, it might not always be, like, positive, but that's just life. Like, life isn't always going to go well, so it's going bad. Like I said, my mom always told me to try to keep a smile on my face and you know, I just try living like that. Former presidents, rappers, all these people, do you like it? Uh, I think that's just the Duke effect. Like, Duke is just the, Duke is probably the most well-known team in history. And I just call it the Duke effect with all the celebrities, presidents that like, give us attention. Yeah, Z. Z, they, they put a mic on me for this. Are you serious? Oh, serious? Mic'd up, boy, I'm wired. Now that we're done with the media, uh, we gotta go out to practice now, open practice, so fans are out there, so yeah, we're excited to get this, get this March Madness started. Hey, this is Grant Hill, I'm here in Columbia, South Carolina. So excited to be broadcasting Duke's games here, the first and second round at this site. I'm here with Jim Nance, Bill Raftery, Tracy Wolfson, 
Uh, we'll be on CBS. I'm just super excited. Duke's team this year uh, is fantastic. They've had some signature wins, some buzzer beaters, uh, great road victories, some adversity. Come back from all of that. Had a great showing in the ACC tournament, and I think have a great chance of winning another banner. So it should be a great run. Uh, I'm looking forward to it. Uh, let's, let's see what happens. Go do. No, it's been an exciting day for our team. You know, it's uh, first day, although we're not playing, to just going to uh, do the shoot around for 40 minutes, open crowd, press conferences. The guys are excited. You know, there's an anticipation there. You know, for a number of these guys, it's their first NCAA tournament game. So big day, hopefully take care of business tomorrow. What's up, Dubu Planet? I'm here with Marquise Bolden, and we just got our first round win over North Dakota State. You know, this interview is going to mean a lot to me because I had the same injury, so I feel like that may, gives a little connection. How did it yeah. feel to be back? I mean, it felt good. Uh, obviously, I wasn't there last week to compete with y'all, but y'all did a great job in Charlotte. So, uh, I mean, it feels good, and I'm excited to be back and, and make this run with the team. What do you think you bring to the team? that the fans don't know about? Uh, I feel like I bring a lot of energy and just the inside presence. I mean, obviously, with you doing your thing, you command a lot of attention with RJ, uh, Cam, Trey. I mean, I just feel like I bring that inside presence that we need to make this run. You know, this is my freshman year. Uh, this is my first time in March Madness. What advice do you have for me? I would just tell you that we're not invincible. I mean, anything can happen around this time of the year. Crazy things happen around this time of the year. So for us to just play the type of basketball that got us here is going to be important for us. You heard it here first? Zion Williams and Mark Weiss Bowden, Good Blue Planet. Oh, what's going on? Uh, it's Brandon here. We just had a good uh, practice. We're in uh, Columbia, South Carolina. Um, B53 is back. It's March Madness. I'm ready to go. I'm here with Antonio Vrankovic, number 30. He's crushing pretzels right now. Talk to him about these tiny twists. You're a big guy, but you like tiny twists. <laughs> yeah, that's exactly, that's exactly right. You know, pretzels, they do it. 100 calories in between practices, it's all good, you know what I'm saying? What's something that the people don't know about you? My favorite food is tacos. What do you dress your tacos with? I like ground beef, cheese, and sour cream. And they got that out in Atlanta. What's your favorite taco spot? On the border. We can see if that's actually a good spot. We can confirm with Alex, who's from a uh, Atlanta as well. What's going on, Ayo? About to enjoy this Gatorade shake here. You know, that's something that I, your average fan probably doesn't realize is that recovery and what happens when the cameras are off is probably just as equally as important as game time. But you are from Terelgan. That's a great pronunciation right there. I, I like that, yeah. But is that how you pronounce it? Yeah, Terelgan. These are the things. This is the exclusive peak that you guys have been waiting on. So a lot of people have been wondering, and I think this is a great time to reveal it. You know, we're doing a collab, right? So it's Cam Fam. Jam Fam and B53 Nation coming together for Mega Nation, Mega Fam. Talk to him about it. I'm looking forward to it as well. Long time in the making. What are you up to? Drinking on this apple juice right now. You really do love apple juice. I've noticed that. Can you tell us about that? Uh, I mean, I don't know. The relationship kind of speaks for itself. How are you, J-Rob? Doing well. How are you? I'm doing good, thanks. Quite this spacious locker. It was. Until you got here. We probably won't put it in, but let's just do like a really awkward interview. And when then he and he dunked it? And what was that? Uh, what? You know, J-Rob is a great friend of mine. Unbelievably talented chef. Carpenter. When he when he brought that one uh, when he brought that one back. 
What? He's done a lot, a lot more than anyone would know. That one back on the yesterday during the game. Oh, oh, RJ. He developed a new uh, system. Tell him about that. What? <laughs> when during the timeout. Okay. Um, and then we had. What? <laughs> it's Brandon Besser, B53, here with. Jay Gold. With Jay Gold. We're locking it down. We're at the tournament. We got big games coming up. We appreciate all your support. What's up, guys? We're walking back from our off day on Saturday. I got the guys walking with me. Talk to me, guys. Yeah, Tony O. We're about to go back to the hotel, eat up, rest up today, and then get ready for a big game against UCF tomorrow. We're coming high tomorrow, baby. Yes, sir. That's what we're doing. <laughs> we all got lemon twist strawberries. It's beautiful. They got that. I got, I got the, uh, the island impact. Incredible. What's up, dude, Blue Planet? Zion Williamson here with my brother, RJ Barrett, you know. What was going through your mind when I missed my free throw? Like, what was your mind process for that? I thought I had to get the ball and try to finish it somehow. Javin helped me out. Ran right in front of the dude, and it bounced right to me, and I was able to finish. Dawkins had a really great game against us. He was on fire. For you to take on that defensive assignment at the end of the game, I think that says a lot about you. What do you have to say to the people that don't know about your defense? There was a guy that was hot. I tried to cool him down a little bit. He still scored me a couple times, but, you know, just try to limit his impact. 32 points, 11 rebounds, Sion Williamson. How'd you do it out there, man? Like I told y'all, my mindset is kill is kill, so I was trying to kill. Down by three. You get the ball somehow, and you just go right at Taco. You're able to get that and one at the end, man. What, what was going through your mind? The two and I, our coach looked at us, the whole group, and he said, you guys live for this moment. So when I got the ball, uh, I was going to shoot a three at first, but then Trey was yelling, go, take it to the basket. So we got the ball to the basket. Yes, sir, you heard it here. Duke Blue Planet, we out. You heard it here, folks, boy. You heard it here, folks. You heard it here first, first folks.